All right, guys, <clears throat> it's August 5th, and we've got um, we've got a storm that's not severe, but it's rolling across us uh, right here by Longmont, just coming off the mountains between us and Estes Park and over towards Lyons. You guys can see it right there. Today we're going to do um, Radar Scope 101, Episode 3, utilizing the... Um, utilizing the inspector tool, if you will. So we kind of know what's coming at us, just visually. And, and again, I've looked at radar, but we kind of know what's coming at us visually. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna open my phone here, and um, we're gonna check and see what this looks like. I'm gonna go to my radar scope, open the app, and we're gonna see, here's Longmont, we're gonna hit the soft key on the iPhone to show our location. That's our location right here. And as you can tell, it's just about on top of us. But what I wanna do is just to kinda of use the inspector tool to kinda of show exactly. So right up here up top, you've got some different options. You can do distance, uh, draw, things of that nature. But in this case, we want the inspector tool, okay? So we're going to do the inspector tool, and we're going to slide this around here. And what I'm doing now is I'm basically telling, I'm looking at this cell and seeing where, where the strongest part of the cell is at via the inspector tool in regards to my location. Right there's my location, just to the east of this particular cell. And it looks like about 57, between 55 and 57 dBZ. So it's a pretty strong storm. But admittedly, what I wanted to really show you guys was that you can use this inspector tool in dual plane mode. So for an example, by the way, this down here, I have got the hybrid hydrometer um, classification here. And it's gonna tell me light, moderate rain, things like that hail, things of that nature. What I'm doing here, oh yeah, you guys see that right there? There's some hail and rain just south of lines and due west of me. Now how cool is that? And that's roughly in about 45 to 50 some dBZ. So I'm gonna pan back out and I'm gonna show you guys. Here comes some wind, you guys can hear the wind. And this inspector tool comes in wonderful. If you guys aren't using this inspector tool, it's a beautiful thing because it can really, it can really show you guys kind of, okay, there's just heavy rain, heavy rain, moderate rain, and I see a little bit of hail in there. Hail and rain right there. And that's right on the 50, uh, between I move my finger between oh, there's a 62 dBZ. So it's coming up in reflectivity our reflectivity scan the latest scan is is definitely uh, coming up But more importantly guys you can use this inspector tool If you just click right there, you can use this inspector tool to To go to any product so right now my bottom I'm in the dual pane mode and my bottom um, screen here is going to show me winds. It's it's which way the winds are blowing mode really is what it is uh, and how strong. Now just to show you guys as can hear the thunder and lightning here, see the lightning here, the thunder. Just to show you guys we are uh, we're currently in the core right now and um, the wind is, is kind of pushed past us a little bit but Using the inspector tool, I can see that my location, and you can tell my location's right about right there. We're in about 56 dBZ reflectivity. 56, 50, uh, about 56, between 52 and 56 dBZ right now. So guys, as far as radar scope, and the inspector tool, that's how easy it is to, to, to utilize and use the inspector tool, especially if you know where you're at and 
um, know what's coming at you. You can pinpoint yourself. And then, of course, use that inspector tool. It's wonderful. I use it all the time. So now that you guys really know how to use that inspector tool, I hope that I've been able to help you a little bit um, in using some of the soft keys and whatnot. I'll try to uh, I'll try to do another video on some of the other features in the future. Maybe we'll do episode uh, four, five, six, whatever. Hopefully, the guys at WDT, Steve Miller, my good friend, and some of those folks actually see this and can utilize this um, in some fashion. And, and maybe some of you guys on the Facebook page and whatever can actually utilize this and 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 learn from it. Radar Scope's a great tool. You guys saw it yesterday. This is today. You saw it yesterday in action on a severe storm. Today, uh, just a normal garden variety summer storm, so to speak, with with the inspector tool. So worked out pretty good. That's how easy that inspector tool is. All right, guys, I'm out. Thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Take care.